Uh, so something happened at, at the end of the fight. John Fitch was very quick to leave. Right. And something that I saw was you were one of the first people out of the ring to call him back in. Right. Um, what was that all about? Can you, can um, you know, uh, me and John, we had to hang out a little bit, and I have a lot of respect for him. You know, so I just wanted to make sure that uh, I, I, I said thanks for bringing out the best in me. You know, and I, I know how that feels. To he didn't expect that. You know, and it was he was. Uh, I'm sure he was very upset and wanted to get the hell out of there. So you know, I just. Uh, that, that was it. You know, I just wanted to you know, grab him and say, hey, you know, it's, and I'm sure he was, he was upset. He wanted to get the hell out of it. So you think it was more just because of how fast everything happened that it wasn't really anything personal or anything like Absolutely. that? Absolutely. Yeah, I think he was just, you know, stunned and probably, you know, pissed off and wanted to get out of there, you know. So, but I, uh, I wanted to at least make sure, you know, I said, you know, thanks because I really look forward to the challenge John Fish gave me. And all, I think I just, I, I said to him, hey, go beat somebody and let's have number three. Yes. And then that's what kind of leads into what do you think is next for John Fitch? Uh, he's new to the organization. Not a great first performance, but he is definitely one of the top contenders right. here. What do you think? No, I mean, I think John Fitch has a bright career in front of us. You know, uh, I think he just needs to, uh, you know, I mean, me saying this about John Fitch, you know, right, is humbling in itself. But I think uh, this organization is going to continue to grow, and guys like John Fitch are going to help it grow. And then John Fitch has been, for a very long time, been in the top ten of the all-time division. How, how do you feel right now? Uh, you know, I feel great. I, you know, I was in the top ten when John Fitch beat me. Mm -hmm. I had beat Drew Fickett, and he was number ten, and then I, I got me to number nine. And then John Fitch beat me, and that's how he broke into the top ten, you know, shortly after that. So it's a thing, kind of like things came full circle, and I feel like uh, I get to start my career again from, from here. Well, congratulations, Josh. Appreciate it very much.